food is the ingredient that brings us together. Hello everyone, today we're going to uh, go to Chicken World and uh, try some of their burgers as well as their uh, fried chicken. Uh, so we were told actually that they have a special uh, burger that they're releasing today. So hopefully we can uh, get to try it and uh, give you guys our review. The great thing about Chicken World is uh, that they're uh, 96th Avenue, I believe it's on 96th. Um, has also a drive-through so for those people who uh, are a little bit busy they could actually take advantage of their drive-through uh, rather than coming inside so as you can see they got their sign halal and you can also follow them on uh, Facebook let's go inside and you see what they have We're inside the Chicken World's uh, 96th uh, Avenue location. They've recently renovated it. It's really nice inside. It's lots of space for families. And lots of uh, open space. It's actually. Besides fried chicken, they also have Arabian rice, rice and spice as well as uh, peri peri grilled uh, chicken we got a chance to try their spicy and non-spicy fried chicken as well as the rice bowl the nashville uh, burger and their uh, gabar burger here we have the Nashville uh, burger which has a, a juicy piece of chicken between two sesame buns it's topped with uh, pickles, coleslaw um, as well as their house spicy sauce which is extremely delicious and uh, juicy. Each bite is extremely flavorful you get that kick from the heat and the coolness of uh, the coleslaw which prepares you for the next bite. Next we have the Gabar burger uh, which is two pieces of uh, fried chicken between sesame bun along with uh, cheese and some uh, lettuce. Uh, this uh, also has a little bit of uh, their house made uh, sauce but it's not uh, spicy at all. They have a very cool team. Uh, their uh, burger uh, item uh, names are based on a uh, Bollywood movie, Shole. And that's where uh, the names of the characters are used for the burger. So for example, Gabar. Basanti as well as uh, the next one that they're coming with Billo. So got a little bit of reference to that It's, it's kind of uh, fun and as well as pretty cool The burger is extremely juicy although the chicken is uh, fried. It's not dry So the outside is crispy, but the inside is still soft tender and juicy next We have the uh, rice bowl which basically have uh, kind of like pieces of uh, popcorn chicken with the rice The rice is extremely flavorful. It's kind of like uh, biryani but it has a lot of rich uh, flavors uh, and uh, each piece of the rice you can actually uh, taste it. It's not uh, soggy but rather it's uh, uh, cooked really well, extremely flavorful and it was one of my favorite dishes to try. The chicken is topped with their house made uh, sauce which is creamy and just a little uh, spicy um, which gives you lots of uh, flavor but it's not overpowering. Next we have two uh, types of fried chicken, one is just the regular, another one is the spicy one. Uh, the chicken, the outside is extremely crispy, but yet the inside is uh, soft. Uh, and as you can see, um, we have it on a paper plate and the paper plate is actually not too oily given that these uh, chickens are fried. So they were extremely delicious, crispy outside, juicy inside and not uh, oily at all.
The next item is their uh, peri peri fries, which is basically spiced up uh, fries. It's really flavorful. Um, you get uh, hints of uh, sweetness, spiciness, saltiness, all in one bite. Uh, a lot of uh, flavors uh, that go with that uh, Nashville uh, burger with that uh, creaminess of the coleslaw as well as the coolness and when you have this fries it's just a great match uh, with that burger. So besides ketchup as well as regular hot sauce, they also have this uh, chili garlic sauce that uh, they actually get shipped from Pakistan. So let's try that as well. I put a little bit earlier. Let's try it with a masala fries and then see how it tastes. Mmm. Wow. It's not spicy, but it's kind of like um, if, if you mix the uh, ketchup or sweet and sour with, with kind of like garlic flavor. So it has a little bit of a hint of spice, but it's more sweeter and garlicky flavors. On August the 18th at 9.30 p.m., uh, the Pakistani musician Abrar al Haq will be visiting the restaurant uh, to launch the new uh, Nashville Billow Burger. The restaurant had great service, the staff was welcoming, and this was actually one of the only restaurants where the owner was walking around in the lobby greeting the customers, listening to their suggestions and feedback. So that's a great thing to see. Outside of the restaurant, the patio area, inside as well as the drive through um, was free of any uh, garbage or debris and as well inside was really well clean, well lit and organized. The food was delicious, it was really flavorful um, and the chicken was not uh, oily at all. So we had a great experience overall. If you like this video please make sure to give it uh, a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed what are you waiting for hit that subscribe button thank you